Ladies and gentlemen, Six Fig Stock Trader here on YouTube, folks. Today we are going to be talking Nervous Network CKB. But before we do, give me a follow on Twitter at Real Six Fig. This is where I'm dropping news, charts, upcoming live streams, upcoming videos, things like that. So with that said, I just wanted to thank everyone for 100,000 views in the last 28 days. You can see that this is 76,000 more views than usual. And when it, when it comes down to it, um, the comments and stuff like that, that roll in, I feel bad that I'm not able to get to all of them. There's just so many that it's just, it's impossible to get to every single one. So if you did leave a comment on the channel, I do apologize if I have not responded to you. It's just, there's so many now. Uh, but with that said, uh, thank you all. I, I truly appreciate it more than you know. If you guys could smash the like button, if you guys could subscribe, like it would mean the world to me, and I sincerely appreciate it. So now let's take a super high-level look and breakdown of CKB. It's really kind of trading within this three cent range to two and a half cent range. Like I said the other day, you know, I don't think we're going to see this really move uh, too much lower or higher than that until, you know, November 17th ish, somewhere in there, give or take a day or two. Uh, but one thing I wanted to point out on this weekly chart is price tags right now are just under three cents. So this is huge. And I'd like to just say that we are kind of somewhere right up in here. And we are looking at holding, if we can hold this ground for the next 19, 20 hours, we will close this candle above the cloud. In addition, we will start a new candle possibly above the cloud. But I do think that at this point, we might see a symmetrical triangle or something like that form on a weekly chart uh, to really start ripping. So I'm excited about this. I'm excited for the possibility of getting some sort of bullish pattern formation on the weekly chart above the cloud. That's huge. I want you guys to understand that. So here is kind of what's going on still right now with CKB. So here's the daily chart. Uh, when we were back on November 7th, you know, I kind of been telling everybody we're way too far away from this cloud to move up anytime soon and we have seen price action really kind of limp along sideways and now we are starting to see the potential symmetrical triangle that is forming off a nice bull flagpole so we do have this kind of going for us at the moment and bear with me one second here while I get this. I had everything worked up and then we did a live stream on Crypto Airborne's channel last night, which was a lot of fun. So my charts got erased. Doesn't matter because we can see that this symmetrical triangle is really squeezing into this November 17th, November 18th date. Like I've been kind of predicting something's going to happen with the market on those days. I just have a feeling. So we might not be able to realize what it is in real time once that date comes around. It might be something that we look back in hindsight on. But I do suspect that a vibration throughout the cryptoverse will be felt on that that those days somewhere in there we're seeing those numbers come up on bitcoin we're seeing it come up on the total crypto market cap there's something brewing uh, something going on right now so we have one of two things happening here we do have this argument for the symmetrical triangle that could be forming and as you can see if we really tighten this up this really is pointing to right around this November 17th, late, late hours of November 16th. Uh, but we could also make the argument that there could be some sort of ascending triangle uh, that could be forming as well. And we might be seeing this thing maybe take its sweet old time to get there, you know, we might see uh, something like this happen. We might see this fluctuation between 0.033 cents and you know 0.026 cents for the next four to five days is my prediction. So I'm thinking either way, 
I like the outcome, whether it's the symmetrical triangle or this ascending triangle that forms on the daily chart. And we can see how price action at that point would kind of have moved closer into this shoulder of the cloud. We can see the last time this happened, bear with me one second here. So if we get this, let's just say November 17th date, this is when price action starts ripping up. We can see that what happened the last time, price action had to consolidate. We got closer to the shoulder of the cloud and then we went up. So we might be seeing this consolidation closer to this shoulder and then moving up once again. So I do think that uh, right now, CKB is still looking really, really good uh, to me right now. So uh, whether or not the 17th and 18th are relevant, uh, only time will tell, and we really need to just be patient at this point in time uh, because, like I said, time will tell, and we just can't really rush these things. You know, we might see something November 19th. You know, I'd say November 17th through the 19th, somewhere in there, give or take a day, is when the market is going to start making some moves here, especially with CKB. So I'm hoping we don't have Bitcoin shake us out like we had happen back in April. I think that would be a devastating blow to the holders of CKB and just the rest of the crypto market in general. It'd be nice to see these cryptocurrencies and altcoins really detach themselves from Bitcoin. But really, folks, that's all I've got on CKB for the most part. Like I said, we are just kind of waiting, uh, in a sense, to see which route we kind of follow here. Either we're going to squeeze into the symmetrical triangle or we are going to follow this ascending triangle. I do firmly believe that. So until tomorrow, I'll try to drop another video tomorrow, especially if anything crazy happens, but don't be surprised if I don't because there really isn't a reason for me to take your time if we're just squeezing sideways and I can predict that in this video. Um, so it's one of those things. Big shout out to all the Patreons. If you're interested in becoming a Patreon, three bucks a month, get your name, YouTube channel name, or business name up on this banner. Thank you everyone for watching. If you could please smash that like button and subscribe on the way out, that would be much appreciated. Hope you all have a wonderful weekend wherever you are at in the world.